Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Senza. If you are new here, if you're a returning subscriber, a regular regular, I welcome you back. Okay, so as you guys can see on the title of the video, that today we're gonna be discussing five signs that he is a red flag. Okay, that your guy that you're currently busy with, or that guy that you're currently going out on dates with. Or if you're still searching for a perfect guy, which signs to look out for that are red flags. Do you understand? So I am here to put you guys on. Okay, so ladies, sit down and relax because it's about to go down. So let's get right onto this video. Okay, guys, so now I have my little notepad here with me so i had to write them down because like i didn't want to like you know to have everything all over the place and like i don't really know what i'm saying you know like it's really important like to have everything in order do you understand so yeah so number one okay he doesn't take you out on dates yeah he doesn't take you out on dates like if a guy does not take you out on dates and he's always telling you oh um when are you gonna come to my place come to my place you know let's chill let's do whatever like girl i mean like if a guy is really interested in you for the first time like he must take you out on dates like at least two three or four even five dates before you can go to his place do you understand like so that you show that okay you know what like let me take you out on a date you are a lady you know i respect you do you understand because now if a guy you, you have never even met them or maybe you met them once and then all of a sudden now he wants you to come to his place so basically like that must be alarming like what do you take me for am i your booty call eh am i your booty call my dear what is it <laughs> do you understand so nah for me that's like that's a big 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 red flag do you understand? Yeah, I think my fingers are up. <laughs> so yeah, like th like that's a big red flag. Like if we don't know each other like that, and if we're getting to know each other, take me out on dates. Do you understand? Like if a guy does not take you out on dates, ah, babes, relax. That guy is not into you. He cares less about you. Just wants to sleep with you, and that's it. Do you understand? So, babe. Be mindful of the guys that you go out with, okay? So yeah. And then number two, he shows no interest about knowing you. Yeah, so basically it's like this, like if when you meet or maybe when you text him on WhatsApp or any other social media platforms where like you guys are communicating and he shows no interest about you, like how's the day like, what are you up to, okay, what are you doing? You know, um, what do you like? What do you like? What type of style, you know, do you like? Like, what, what's your favorite clothes? What's your, you know, like a person that shows that like they're interested and they really want to know you. If they don't show that, my dear, now, nah. because of like, huh, how can I put this? I was once involved with a guy, and it, it, he really showed no interest, you know, like about knowing me, what it is that I like, what da 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 what he was always talking about it was sex 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 you know and i was like mm -mm. you know like oh i imagine you wearing a bikini ooh, you know those talks like oh i wonder how you look in a bra what size is your bra like my dear like really now are we doing this speak on me Ooh, are we really doing this like why why are we doing this do you understand so no <laughs> okay no 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 so if he shows no interest that he wants to know you better then now uh, what's your favorite like you know like small things like what's your favorite sport like where do you like eating what do you like eating you know um uh, what do you like What's your favorite drink? Simple, simple things. A person that's interested in you, they're gonna ask you simple questions and they would want to know about, you know, your life. Who do you stay with? Where does your mom stay? Okay, how did you grow up? Do you understand? Like, they just want to know what type of a person that they're dealing with. You understand? It shows that, okay, this person is interested. So if your guy is not doing any of that, please throw that thing in 
in the trash. Throw it in the trash because they're not for you, my honey. Okay? He is a red flag. Okay? Thank you. <laughs> and then number three, he's a narcissist. Hmm. I hate narcissist guys. I bet. I hate narcissist guys. Like, if you're a man and you're so narcissist, I just don't get it. Like, my God, why, why, <laughs> why, why would you do that? Okay, wait. If you don't know what a narcissist means, a narcissist means that a person feels so highly of themselves. Do you understand? Like they want to control each and every situation. Do you understand? Like they want to manipulate you. They want to make you feel so less of yourself. Like a person that's narcissist, they always want to feel like they are God. Do you understand? And you, like, you must bow down to them and be like so submissive to them to a point where they want to rule the world. They also want to rule you and they also want to control you. Do you understand? So like I don't like narcissistic men. No, 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 no. Like everything that he says goes. Do you understand? And sometimes like so like it's someone that always like feels so highly of themselves and so entitled, you know. Um a narcissist like if they feel like it's okay, a woman must do this. Okay, you are a woman, you must clean, you must do this, you must you must cook. Me, I'm a man, I must just sit and, and relax. You understand? That's a very that's a person that's very narcissistic. Like I I just don't like they feel like they are higher than you you know like they know everything in the world you know uh, nah. I, I don't like people like that you know like i don't know like that so if you are like that then you are not my type of coffee if your guy is narcissistic girl if, if you are comfortable with that it's okay because nothing about us fine but with me i don't want it i do not want it like if you're a narcissist, please relax and chill like that. Because like sometimes a narcissist, like a person that's narcissist, ne, sometimes they wouldn't even want to talk to you sometimes. They'll be so moody. They wouldn't want to talk to you. They will talk to you when it suits them. And when they come back and they want to talk to you now, and then you must be okay and be like, oh yeah, ha ha ha. Oh, so you are silent, ha 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 ha. You know, so like if you are currently dealing with a narcissistic person, I would advise you to mirror their actions. Do you understand? Like, if they're not talking to you, don't talk to them back. One time, if they're not talking, if they're not talking to you, don't talk to them back. If they're not, if they're acting weird, now they act weird. Like Jay, like just go with their flow. Do you understand? Because like, but when I start to speak, like, but at the attention, like they love so much attention. They want you to, you know, to always be like, hey, to beg them and. Me, I'm not the type of girl that begs. I don't beg a man, honey. Okay? I don't. There's a lot of men out there. Like, you're not special. Nah. Mm -mm. <laughs> okay, and then number four. Okay? He keeps you as a secret. Ha ha ha. The guy is keeping you as a secret. My sister, when he meets you, you meet in pri like, private places. You know, private restaurants, far away from maybe where he stays or whatever. It doesn't really matter, but like he keeps you as a secret. You know nothing about his friends. His friends don't know you. Family members don't know you. Like nobody that's close to him knows you. That guy, my dear, is a red flag. That guy like wants nothing. Like it's a silhouette. Do you understand? Like they just want to push time with you. And then they get what they want and then they out. Do you understand? So if he's not inviting you over and say, ah, babes, you know what? Let's meet. You know, um, I'm gonna be having a bride. My friends will be here. My cousins will be here. Come over. If he's not inviting you to those type of setups, my dear, run. That guy does not want you. <laughs> run, 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 run as fast as you can. Okay, that guy does not want you. He need like a bona. So if he keeps you as a secret, my sister, just know that that guy like is not for you. And like, I know sometimes like you know when you're in love and like you you wanna be in denial. You can see that but this guy is like you know what he's a red flag. But you wanna be in denial. You still wanna force because you enjoy being with that person. But they're not treating you the right way. Or understand? 
so it's good for you it will be good for you to walk away please do that like walk away like you've got nothing to lose really because like i kind of feel like if you're still busy with that person you're wasting time for yourself as well you understand and like you're closing the chances of you meeting like the right guy <laughs> do you understand so girl look out for those guys next if you are dealing with someone like that babe i say run leave that person okay and then number five the last one the guy is too secretive so basically like you know nothing about him don't know anything about their family don't know anything about where they work what they do you know where they were born like in jail, this person is so secretive anything that has to do with his personal life we know nothing about it we only know those small small things like he yeah maybe he stays in Clinton. yeah he stays in Clinton. we don't even know where he stays we don't even know his house he's never taken you to his house he's never couldn't jail like you only meet in jail in public and that's it like you know nothing about this person he's very very secretive Mm-mm. you see now you're like you're playing with a dangerous person because of like for me for me like if you are secretive ask myself like maybe what if like you have a wife you know maybe you have a wife you have a family that's why you're secretive make it make sense so for me those are the five red flags if your guy is doing any of these things babe run 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 like run run as fast as you can because why are you still sitting there like why are you still with this person you can see that this person is a total red flag but you're still chilling there like you're just sitting there so look out for the red flags ladies you know like take pride in yourself be that girl you know know what you want because of like if you keep on like chasing that guy then they're gonna be like so I say, you know what? Come up, pull your own clothes, you know. So if your guy is doing any of these five signs, or they have these five signs, then I say, vamos, okay? Know your worth. You are the queen, okay? You are the queen. So yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. It was really nice shooting this video, you know, and sharing my two cents. And each and everything that I'm saying here, it's based on experience, okay? It's what I went through. So it's not something that I've heard from, from the next person or from anybody else. Like, it's literally things that I went through. So I'm here to share them with you ladies, you know? And then, yeah. But I'll see you guys next week, Thursday. Um, please make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe to this channel, okay? Road to 500 subscribers. I see you guys. We are currently sitting at 420 subscribers. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. <laughs> I appreciate you guys, okay? Please, let's push this video to 500 subscribers. Just make sure that you like this video because at least when you like this video, it pushes you know my video to other audiences they can see that oh okay there's this girl her name is sandra she's the ish you know she's got us do you understand so please you know spread some love show some love and, and subscribe to my channel man yeah and yeah guys um also if you'd like to connect with me you can follow me on instagram it's sandra underscore jelly and then also you can also follow me on tiktok it's sandra m937 okay so please do the right thing okay and yeah i'll have to love and leave you okay i need to shoot a thumbnail for this video <laughs> and yeah love you lots Mwah. bye